What's up guys, my name's Mike with Abby's Designs. Today we're gonna to be building a wine glass holder. Um, pretty simple project, doesn't take much materials, just a little bit of effort, some, some key cuts and drilling some holes, and uh, then we'll put some finish on it and uh, it'll be ready to go. So let's get started. So I'm using oak for this project. This is a one by 10 board I had sitting around, which means it's only nine and a quarter inches wide. Use the radial arm saw to get it nice and square. And then the drill press to drill out a center hole here for which is gonna accept the neck of the wine bottle. And then four more smaller holes around the corners to accept the wine glasses using the band saw to connect the little um, slots that are gonna allow the wine glasses to slide in there. This is gonna be a gift for a wedding that we're going to this summer. That shot took me about four different tries, so I'm not that good. Then I used a file to clean out the insides of those slots, fine tune them to allow them to um, fit a different sized wine glasses, being a little bit careful and cognizant to not uh, blow out an entire corner because there's not a lot of wood there towards the ends of the, the piece. And I filed out the center hole and made that a little bit rounded over um, as much as I could with the file and then sanded it and we were ready for the next step. All right guys, so it's all sanded. Um, we got it all filed, it's looking pretty good. Um, I talked to my fiance and what we decided to do was to write the date of their wedding um, in here on the bottom piece right here. Um, I'm actually gonna burn it in to the wood. Um, so I'm getting set up to do that right now. I got my wood burning tool getting heated up. I'm gonna burn that date in there. And then I got it stencil stenciled out here to give myself a little bit of a reference. Try to make it look halfway decent. <clears throat> and then uh, the next steps are gonna be to put stain um, on the uh, entire piece and then put some clear coats on it. So I'm gonna go, go ahead and do all that and uh, we'll take a look at it when it's all done. All right guys, wine glass holder is all done. Um, I burnt the date of their wedding into the side right here, put some stain, put some clear on it. This bad boy is ready to go. So let me show you how this works. I have a wine bottle right here. Set the piece on it just like that. Slide these wine glasses in from the sides, just like this. And now we are ready to party. Um, Guys, it's been a really fun project. This is really simple, really easy. Definitely doesn't take a lot of materials, does not take a lot of tools, does not take a lot of time. So if I can build it, anybody can build it. Um, I really hope you guys enjoyed watching me build it. And uh, we really think that the newlyweds are gonna love it too. So let me know what you think in the comment section below. And uh, thank you for watching. Now I gotta go wash these wine glasses before my fiance gets home. That was close. Beyonce would have killed me if I broke her nice wine glass. I'm gonna have to clean it too. Sawdust everywhere. All right guys, so the wine glass holder is all done. Got the date of the newlyweds wedding um, burnt into it right here. Put a coat of stain on it and then some uh, clear coat. Come on, Mike. Can you speak? <laughs> All right, guys. So the wine glass. We uh, are excited to give this to the newlyweds. We hope they enjoy it as much as uh, I've had building it. <laughs> That's so stupid.
All right, guys.